the increased quality of rifles, ammunition, and optics is driving the market segment to new highs. What was impossible 10 years ago is now possible for many shooters. Today's shooters demand a host of special features that were custom-only options just a few years ago, from stock adjustability and threaded muzzles to carbon fiber-wrapped barrels and even AR-style handguards. Each year, hunters are faced with a myriad of new firearms from which to choose from. The choices can be overwhelming, so we've done our best to sift through the masses and compiled a list of the best long-range rifles along with their specifications to help you choose the perfect one to suit your needs. What we found was an impressive crop of highly innovative, extremely accurate, and, in a few cases, surprisingly affordable rifles. Hey, pretty excited to show you our latest addition to the Skunk Works lineup. We're going to call this thing the Light Saber. The reason we're calling this the lightsaber is because it's light and it's, it's very deadly. The chassis on this particular rifle is made out of magnesium, so it's very, very light. You can tell the folding hardware here, it's all aluminum with carbon fiber, so shave some weight there. And then another cool feature on this chassis is this printed titanium grip. We're just losing ounces everywhere we can. The stock also has the M-lock slots, and so you can add all kinds of hardware, including your night vision rails, etc. So we've got our bipod rail and then our QD mounts that come standard with this gun. Uh, we paired up with some pretty cool optics this time. Uh, we're using a little one and a half to eight power Schmidt and Bender scope, K26 on the objective. But we've got 32 minutes of correction in this thing and a nice reticle that we can hold for some wind. So fast target acquisition, kept the weight down, still have plenty of juice to shoot out there a long ways. Another real cool feature about this weapon is the barrel. All right, it looks heavy, it's not. This is actually a titanium sleeve on a suppressed barrel. So if we take the cap off here, you're gonna see some pretty cool stuff here. So all the baffles, expansion chamber, etc., is machined into this barrel from the get-go. To make it suppressed, we're just going to add that titanium sleeve. So not only are we taking a lot of weight off, we're reducing the decibel level significantly. When you get in a hurry on those fast shots, what this gun is made for, having earplugs is, is still recommended, but you're going to get away without it if you need to. So lightweight, super foldable. This thing's only 33 inches overall length when it's folded. We're 42 uh, when it's not folded, but this thing straps perfectly onto the side of a backpack. I mean, we're just right around seven pounds without the optics, so we've got a really, really light configuration that's good for mountain hunting. This compact rifle here is chambered in a 338 Ruger Compact Magnum, so we're shooting a 225 grain bullet, 25, 2600 feet per second, and so whether you're shooting hogs at night or you're in Alaska chasing moose, hunting bears out of a ground blind or even whitetails out of a tree stand, uh, this package is going to get the job done. Uh, you can strap it onto your backpack and carry it up in the mountains. It's a great lightweight, packable, compact rifle. I'm here to introduce the new Delta 5 Pro. So about two years ago, we launched the Delta 5. While people have received that product greatly and they, they love everything about it, We've been listening to the consumer and with two years of work, we've basically turned the dial to 11 on everything for this rifle. This rifle is really meant to give you every advantage you can get from a custom rifle builder, but at that production price standpoint. So the MSRP of this rifle is gonna be $2499.99. So it squeaks in underneath that $2,500 limit set by the PRS. Uh, but this is not just gonna be for the PRS competitive shooter. It's gonna be for anybody that wants to squeeze every bit of efficiency out of their rifle as possible. First and foremost, this rifle's coming standard with a half minute of angle guaranteed. So the rifle can do it, now it's just up to you. So some of the custom features we've added to this gun, right from the factory, give you a Area 419 Hellfire three port brake, a great muzzle brake that's gonna keep the recoil as well as muzzle rise down to keep you on target. Underneath the muzzle brake, it's going to be threaded 5 8 24 on the barrel. That way, if you want to swap it out to a, a suppressor, you can. The barrel itself is still the cold hammer forged barrel, where we forged the contour, the bore, and the chamber at the same time, resulting in an extremely concentric barrel that's extremely accurate. Uh, moving more towards the rear, we have our rail system. This has a couple unique features. Starting off, it has uh, one of the first production Area 419 integrated ARCA lock systems. 
This is compatible with any really right stuff, arc or dovetail accessory. Uh, moving to the, the side, you have plenty of M-lock slots for other accessories as well as M-lock on our front bridge. Whether you want to run thermals or night vision, you've got plenty of options up here. Moving further to the rear, we have our scallop in the top of our rail. This is, as you can see, allows our objective lens to be really low, minimizes our side over bore measurement, which can result in errors at really long distance if it's not exact. Uh, moving more towards the rear, the front of the chassis base, you do have a barrier stop to protect your magazine from causing any potential misfeeds from jamming that mag uh, to the rear. Speaking of the magazine, it's gonna come with a Magpul AICS 10 rounder this time, keep you on the gun a little bit longer. Same great Delta 5 three lug action, and it's gonna come with the Timney Hunter Elite trigger. Moving to the rear of the chassis base, uh, we have what we call a thumb stop. Some people refer to it as a gas pedal, but it basically allows your thumb to have a resting spot on the chassis. Whether you wanna shoot it strong side or weak side, uh, these are not only adjustable for forward and back, but also left or right, so you can run it on either side of the rifle. On the, the very back of the chassis base is our attachment method for our grip. So it's an AR-15 compatible grip System. It comes with our DDM4 overmolded grip. It's a very comfortable grip, but we know that grips are real personable to people, so we wanted to make sure you could change it out to something if you have a different shooting style, wanted something more angled or more vertical. That's your little place where you can personalize your rifle. Moving on to the buttstock frame, we've kept the adjustability in the cheek piece for waterline up and down, as well as drifting left, right, and toe in and toe out making sure that we have a nice line of contact on our cheek instead of a point. Uh, the only thing we've added on this one is there's a spring that lets you set the height so you do not have to manually hold the cheek riser in place when you're setting your cheek height and getting that right eye relief behind the glass. Coming back to our length of pull system, we have two friction knobs as well as a thumb wheel that will allow you to run that length of pull in or out to get that right fit on the rifle. And then our length of pull system also has a height adjustment on the actual butt pad that is watermarked on the left side of the rifle so you can reset it if you have to change it for another shooter or you're changing it to clean the rifle. As well as this butt pad also has adjustments for cant uh, in or out. So in addition to this great chassis we've designed for the Delta 5 Pro, we've also provided a new contour that you can choose. It's a, a what we're calling a varmint. It's gonna be 910 at the muzzle, so just under an inch at the, at the shoulder. It's a very heavy profile, a little bit larger than our 750 at the muzzle for our H Palma. This barrel's a little bit more rigid, as well as it soaks up a, a lot more heat than the, uh, the H Palma can take. Basically lets you stay on that gun a little bit longer without any thermal drift. It's an extremely accurate barrel. Uh, the varmint contours are gonna come in 26 inches and available in 6.5 Creedmoor as well as 6 Creedmoor. So whether you're just now starting to think about getting into long range shooting, or if you've been shooting for some time and just looking for that next piece of kit to step up your game to the next level, this is the solution for you. The Delta 5 Pro brings all of the features and all the accuracy of those high-end custom rifles, but it brings it to you at a production price point. This rifle will be shipping in three different colors, standard black anodized, coyote tan, or olive drab green. Today I wanted to introduce you to the newest X-Bolt, the Max Long Range. Now the Max Long Range has the same great features that you expect from every X-Bolt. It's got the short 60 degree bolt throw. It's got the safety that locks the bolt, but with the convenient bolt unlock button, you can empty the gun with the, while it's on safe. It has the, the center feed Palmer magazine and the feather trigger that's adjustable and comes straight out of the box with a crisp trigger pull. The X-Bolt has the best production barrels in the industry and, and, and that's where your accuracy comes from. And all the barrels are free floated. Well, let's talk about the Max and how it's different. You can see that this is set up in a long range configuration with a, with a scope with a larger main tube for more adjustments and also on an accessory 20 MOA Picatinny rail. We start with the muzzle brake, which reduces recoil by about half. We also supply a thread protector if you do not want the muzzle brake muzzle blast while hunting, you can replace it with the thread protector. It does have an extended bolt handle, make a little bit easier operation of the bolt. What you're going to notice first about the Max Long Range is the new stock. This is a Browning stock and it has a lot of great features for long range shooting. 
As you can see, it's sitting here on the bipod. It has a swivel stud for the bipod and an additional swivel stud for a sling attachment. For those that have bipods that attach via Picatinny rail, we'll have an accessory rail that's specifically made for this stock, has the Picatinny section, also a sling attachment. It'll come supplied with screws and it'll be a clean addition to the rifle as it's made specifically for this stock. One of the greatest features for long range shooting is the vertical pistol grip. And you can see that the, the Max stock has that. The vertical pistol grip has a, gives you a great feel when you're shooting prone or off the bench and sets your hand up to put your finger nicely on the trigger.